welcome to java forum now i am going to show you how to compile and run c and c++ program using gnu compiler in fedora 39 workstation so first we need to check whether uh, gcc compiler for c and c++ installed or not so this is the command uh, to check whether uh, gcc compiler for c and c++ is installed or not Yes, for C and C++ compiler are available. Okay, so now I am going to show you how to compile and run the C program. So before that, I will let me show you C and C++ file. So this is my C program. It will simply print one welcome message. And CPP program, this will print a welcome message. Now, first I am going to show you how to compile the uh, C program. GCC welcome.c, iPhone O welcome. Yes. Output file will be created. Dot slash welcome. Yes. I can able to compile and run the C program. Now, let me try for C++. Yes, let me run, yeah. Okay, so now I am able to run the, compile and run the C++ program also. Now I am going to show you one important command, gcc h, that is hyphen h option. I am going to compile with hyphen h option. So what is the usage of hyphen h is, it will show what are the header files used by this program. You can see lot of header files are printed, which means that these are the header files uh, loaded in the memory stack. Okay, these are the header files loaded by single C program. And this is for C++. See here, C++ uh, uses lot of header files than C. So lot of header files are loaded in the memory stack. So this command will be useful for the beginners who are searching for the header files uh, location, okay. So basically all header files will be uh, located in slash usr slash include directory. So GNU GCC compilers will take the header files from slash usr slash include directory only. And there is a separate directory for C++. Okay. So this is the way we need to compile and run C and C++ program using GNU compiler in Fedora 39.